You're listening to the It's Only Rock and Roll podcast, and I like it. We started in uh, Cleveland, and the next night we had to play up in Detroit, which is even more of a hometown of crowd for us. I'm telling you, it was really revved up, and the people were out of their seats, and they were up to the stage, and they were with the band, and we were fixing to go into inside looking out, and all of a sudden the power goes down. I look around because the only thing I'm hearing is drums. I turn around, Brewer's still playing. So Terry Knight comes walking out, grabs the microphone and tells the audience, due to contractual obligation with Led Zeppelin, Grand Funk Railroad has to leave the stage now. And all the crowd just start booing and throwing wine bottles, whiskey, a beer bottle. We waited an hour and a half for Led Zeppelin to go on. And by that time, more than half the audience had already emptied out. They went home. 